Materials provided by Micromark. We got a free box of paints in the mail! Big Bob, I thought we were spray paint guys. We are! Can we really get a good paint job on our models using acrylic paints? I don't know, little Bob. Let's give it a try so our buddy watching can decide if he wants to try it. On today's acrylic, acrylic paint, paint challenge. challenge! Our buddy wants to know, why acrylics? Hey, buddy. Well, acrylics are water-based. They're quick drying and easier to use. You can safely paint inside or outside. There's no free chemicals in the air, like with rattle cans. Ah, this gift is too dang generous. You're mad about that? It's just, Big Daddy was always giving us expensive gifts like this. I just brushed him off, and then he left. You were a teenager. Cut yourself some slack. I never want to make that mistake again. I'm going to get a good finish with these acrylic paints, or die trying. That's kind of dramatic. Life is dramatic. Let's unbox the set. Yellow is the most challenging color in my opinion. It's the color of the sun. It stands for energy, joy, vitality, and friendship. My kind of color. But on the flip side, negative things like jealousy, bile, and betrayal. Yikes. Sometimes working on a model feels like a betrayal, right? You put all this time and effort in and it turns on you. Getting the materials right up front can save you from that. Buddy, if you decide you want to try this paint set, use our discount code 25 times 10. That knocks 10% off your purchase price and it helps support our channel. Everybody wins. But first we have to win the acrylic paint challenge. What are the rules again? Three models, three techniques, and we have to be happy with the finish we put down. Got it. Here's another mid-tone. Burnt Sienna. I like these. They'll be good for weathering. Whoops, did I get you? If you'd got me, I'd be dead. Death by fallow. Hey Josh, can you Google fallow for us? It's gonna kill me, I wanna know what it is. This is a very impressive color range for under 30 bucks, I gotta say. What if our buddy's not so green? Even if you're not a beginner, maybe you're looking to add new tools to your toolbox. Maybe you want to know about using the safer water-based acrylic paints instead of creating a toxic hazard every time you go to paint a model. Or maybe you're just interested in going for the results that we get in this video using the same paint set and techniques that we use on our models. I like that lamp black. Here's the green fallow. That's a beautiful color. Whatever your situation, there are good points to be learned here. And towards the end of the video, we're going to give away a model kit that you can practice on. I'll stick around for that. Good. Buddy's asking when we plan to start painting. Did you bring a model to work on, buddy? Look out! <laughs> Hot Rod Lincoln! That Model A body makes him look like a pup. Cool. Looks like Big Daddy's deer stand. What is it, a 28 or 29 Ford truck? Think about what color you want it painted. And here's what the FOMOCO was capable of a mere 20 years later. Chop top! So far we chopped the top, fabbed the roof, and converted our two-door model into a four-door. Today we'll finally put some paint on the old Merc. And now, like something out of Jurassic Park, like a mosquito trapped in amber, the only muscle car still rolling off the factory floor, perfectly intact, more than 50 years later, the 1970 Dodge Challenger. You foiled it before painting it? Don't step on my plans. Where'd you get this crazy idea? You know, when the acrylic paints showed up on our doorstep, I went to YouTube to see what Micromark was saying about them. Buddy, I highly recommend Micromark's channel. Tons of super helpful videos about using their tools for model building, We're building models of all kinds. Go check it out. That's where I saw this. <laughs> Micromark's art director, Jolene Oldham, a brilliant artist and product marketer. 
She's really good at connecting with regular guys like us. She inspired me to take the Jolene challenge. Big Bob raises the stakes. Now let's raise them even higher. The only thing better than getting free stuff is giving free stuff, right? Right. What do you think? Give it away, give it away, give it away now. Wait here, baby. What's this? I was checking out the mock-up last night. Looks like you had your body cam on. What were you doing? Just getting a closer look. Through the transmission tunnel? This is an acrylic paint challenge, not a colonoscopy. I might need to know how to hotwire it. Who was that with you? I don't remember her name. Little Bob. Look, let's go to break. When we come back, we'll paint three models, three ways, using acrylic paints from Micromark. So you can decide if you want to try it. Brenda. Lovely. back. We're here at the Fuselage Body Cafe in Candy Corn, Massachusetts, having 25 times more fun painting plastic models. The 49 Merc is our street machine entry for the Blue Ox Model Shop group build. Click these cards to see how we chop the top, fab the roof, and went full grandpa, converting it to a four-door. Now let's paint it. Violet Lamp. Randy said we could use the house airbrush on the back patio. It's raining. So, we'll paint in the rain. You know, I had the Harley out last weekend. I noticed how similar to airbrushing it was. Airbrushing is like riding a Harley? It's a full body experience. Your right foot is planted on the ground. Your left foot is towing their shifter. Your right hand throttles down while the left slowly lets out the clutch. Shoulders over hips, eyes forward, knees up. You pull out onto the road. It's that easy? The difference is, with airbrushing, you want to keep riding the clutch for as long as possible. I heard you shouldn't paint on rainy days. Yeah, let's go in. Hey, hey buddy. Did you pick a color for your cab? He wants Ford Blue. Okay. The consistency of milk. That's canon. This paint set by Micromark. The first thing you notice is how easy it is to use. The paints mix very nicely. They have a strong, vibrant color too. They seem to be highly pigmented. As far as flow, well, it's good quality paint. You can see the silky smooth consistency. It's nice. Soaks up well. How good is the coverage and opacity? The paint builds gradually. Just like airbrushing, it takes several coats. But it does provide exceptional quality. And the finish? It's a matte finish. What do you think? Cool. Buddy, you like it? Big smile. I think these two look amazing together. Hey, interesting question from Sodak Model Cars. How do you approach model building? What's your take? As a storyteller. I feel like I need to tell you something. What do you need to tell me? No, not you. I mean, in general. What are you talking about? Jolene understands. I don't get it. It's okay. How about you? How do you approach models? I go, hey babe, let's bore and stroke. <laughs> I walked right into that one. So, we painted the Merc using technique number one with an airbrush. We painted the Ford using technique number two with a paintbrush. Now we'll try painting the Challenger using technique number three with a sponge. A sponge? Impasto style, like Vincent van Gogh. This is bonkers. Let's see how versatile this paint is. You are going to town. Red is the strongest color. The color of passion, love, and courage. 
It also means rage and war. A touch of color for your favorite hockey team. Go Crimson! Now the fun part. I'll pop in the interior. Snap in the chassis and running gear. Easy. This kit is a joy. If you win it, you're gonna love building it. How do you enter? Just type winner in the comments. Oops, that's kind of fakey. How could the wheel fall off, but the tire stays on? That's like your head falls off, but your mustache stays on. Is the contest open to everyone? Worldwide. We'll ship it to Australia, Canada, UK, Brazil, India, anywhere in the world, even Connecticut. When does it close? So if you're watching this video after September 30th, 2023, well, you're too late, but stick with us. We'll do something like this again. We love to see a winner. Speaking of winners, we challenged ourselves to get a good finish on our models using acrylic paints, and here we are. At the finish line. If it's a winner and you want to try this paint on your models, you get to use our discount code and take 10% off your purchase. What if it's a loser? Well, that would mean we died trying. So dramatic. I really want us to win this. So how'd we do? I'll go first. Love the Merc. Looks amazing. Little Bob? Good. Buddy? Thank you. Everybody likes the Merc. Next. I liked it. You're outvoted. I know I lost the Jolene challenge. I wanted to paint a car, not ice a cake. You're too hard on yourself. You were expressing yourself. But the Jolene Challenger has so much power. Those clouds erupting. Mine doesn't have smoke and clouds erupting. Would clouds make you happy? Well, yeah, but we can't get them. Hold my beer. Where do you think you're... There's no key, you know. Buddy? Big Bob has lost his mind. He's running all through the diner. Buddy, we hope you enjoyed this episode of 25 Times. You're home for having 25 times more fun. If you did, <laughs> pick up a box of acrylic paints on your way out. Link in the description. See you next time. <laughs> Thanks, Spiker Mark. <laughs>